everyone welcome back to my channel and if you are new welcome in today's video I want to talk about bananas and these are ripe bananas now there are several ways in which you could use your ripe bananas and that is by in your skincare regime and also you could use it in your smoothie you could use it for baking you could use it for many different things in your everyday life however there are one thing that sometimes we forget that is very very important and that is the banana peel now today I want to share with you ways in which you could not only use up your banana by eating it but you could also use your banana peel so here we have our banana peel and the first thing I want to show you that you could use this banana peel for is to whiten your teeth so you're going to take the banana peel like this and all you have to do is just get it on your teeth and this might look a mess, but this actually works. So you're going to use it and you're going to rub it all over. And, and you want to do this every day for seven days. And at the end of seven days, you will definitely see results. Now this I have tried and this actually works. Now another thing that banana peel is actually great for is rashes and itches. So if you find yourself itching or you have a rash wherever on your body that is, all you got to do is take your banana peel, ripe banana that is, and you're going to rub it on the area. And you're going to do the, oh, this feels really cool and nice. My skin is actually looking awesome too. So you're going to rub it on the area and you're going to do this three to four times for the day. And in no time, your rashes will disappear and your itching will totally stop. Now the third way that you could use your banana peel is going to be a bit weird, but it's actually work. Now banana peel have a high potassium content and because of the high potassium content, what do you know? Banana peel is perfect for headaches. So you place the banana peel on your head and pressure point preferably. You place one at the back of your neck. You could actually tie this down with a, a tie. And, oh, I need more banana peel. <laughs> anyway, so you place a banana peel, and I like to make sure that it's on pressure point. And you place the banana peel on your head. You take a head tie, and you just tie this on and you leave it there for a couple of hours and in no time, guess what? Your headache will be gone. Who knew? Anyway, you could try it for yourself and see. It actually works. The next way you could use your banana peel is for bruises. And for people with small kids, you definitely need this. So what you do, you take your banana peel and you want to scrape it. And you're going to put this on. So let's say my bruise is right here. I'm going to place it right there. So you're going to leave this on the bruise for several hours. And you could actually sleep with it on the bruise also. And what do you know? In no time, your bruise is going to be better. And I'm sure the kids is going to love this because they tend to like these kind of fancy stuff. So, banana peel for bruises. So, another way in which we could use the banana peel is to get rid of what? Now, I find myself getting a few watts of late. So, I'm definitely using my banana peel to take care of this. So, what do you want to do? 
you want to take your banana peel and where did I see one recently um, somewhere anyway you're gonna take your banana peel and wherever you have that wart you're gonna rub it on and you're gonna do this as a treatment so you want to do this at least twice per day you want to wash it off so you want to do this after you take your shower it's gonna massage the banana skin and the wart and you continue doing this until what do you know your wart will disappear now last but not least and this is something that I don't know if people still do I mean I do and that is to polish your shoes here is a boot of mine that is badly in need of polishing you could see it's one of my favorite I've been wearing it a lot and I have this for a long time but I love it so much so every year I still pull this little baby out so what you want to do you want to take your banana peel and you could see my boot all messy right here and we're gonna just rub our banana peel on it this is like instant polish right here and look at that look at that isn't that amazing so instead of running out to buy yourself polish oh little baby you're getting a nice coating of banana peel polish and there it is my boot all ready and what you want to do you just want to take a, a piece of cloth or something and you take off the excess banana peel and you have your boot nice and polished so next time you choose to have a banana don't throw your peel out save them in your refrigerator for when you have warts or somebody get a scratch or you're itching or you're having a headache or you just want to polish your shoes so there you have it ways in which you could utilize not only your banana but your banana peel thank you for watching and please remember if you like this video give it a thumbs up remember to share and if this is your first time watching please subscribe on your way out and i will see you in my next video Bye-bye.